happy people i'm back with another video and today i'm going to be doing my wash day routine i'm actually going to be testing out some new products i'm going to be testing out this carol daughter's wash day delight um jelly to cream conditioner as well as the wash day delight um love at first wash water to foam shampoo with aloe so these are two new products i actually was sent these uh via influencer so i'm excited to give these a try and see how they work for my hair so first i'm going to Take my hair down out of these um, braids and plaits, and I'll be right back. So I'm going to go ahead and section my hair off into four sections like I normally do. First, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and open up this water to foam shampoo, and I'm going to just put it on the roots of my hair. I normally just put shampoo on the roots of my hair. Now, again, my hair is really, really dirty, so I'm going to do like the first, first rinse through and then come back in. to foam it up nicely. A little bit of curl definition, so that's always good when the hair is
So this is what my hair looks and feels like with three shampoos of the shampoo and one coat of conditioner. It's shrinking up really good, which means that um, the hair is taking to the product pretty well. I feel like it um, it really, the conditioner does work really good as a, a detangler, but um, I don't know how good it feels as actually like conditioning my hair. I typically deep condition anyway, so I'm gonna go ahead and go in with another layer and I'm gonna leave this sitting on my hair for 45 minutes. And I am gonna do this to each section of my hair. Um, and that also gives me a lot more moisture um, whenever I'm washing my hair. So I'm just la lathering the product on. This is how I do with any conditioner that I put into my hair. It's not really making my curls pop too much though. Uh, let me see. I'm trying to rake it all the way through my hair. see it's interesting it does turn into a cream though so this is what it starts off looking and then it actually does turn into a cream so the jelly to cream claim is true oops got some more that's okay though there we go so what i'm gonna do is just leave this sitting on my hair again this is what it looks like this is some good old kinky 4c hair Okay, so I normally twist it up like so, and it is a lot of product on it and that's on purpose. So I'm gonna twist it up. Like so, anything that's extra, I just put right back on that section and I'm gonna wrap it around itself like so and then pin it in place and then I'm gonna repeat this process for all the other sections of my hair. So one thing I did different from these two sec, well, from this section, is I actually rinsed my hair first to get it wet, and then I applied the water to foam shampoo. And I feel like they work better with um, having it lather up quicker and foam up better. Um, and I only washed it twice instead of three times. So FYI, that's what I changed. <laughs> so I let this deep condition. Well, I let this conditioner stay on my hair for about. Um, I want to say like three or four hours. And so I just want to show you all. I washed these two out already, so I need to wash these two out. So I just want to show you how my hair looks after it's been deep, deep conditioned for an extended period. So this is what it looks like. I think as a deep conditioner, it works well. It seems like it penetrated the hair shaft and it, it feels really soft. So as like a regular conditioner to just like put in and take out, don't know that I like it so much, but as a deep conditioner, it feels really good. So I'm going to rinse it out and then I'll show you all how my hair looks. Okay, so this is what my hair looks like after it's been washed and deep conditioned with that. So deep conditioner seems like it works well. Let me give you all my final thoughts on this product, on these products. So with the shampoo, I used about a fourth of the bottle for my wash day and for the conditioner, I used about half of the bottle, as you can see. Um, when it comes to conditioner, I'm very generous on it and I typically go through conditioners way faster than I do shampoos. Um, honest, unsolicited thoughts is I don't like the shampoo. Um, it actually uh, made my hair feel very like stripped, like a bright upon application. So like I felt like my hair was like super dry and got tangled as soon as I put this in my hair. So. Um, I don't know that I would recommend this. I do like the container that it comes in though and the fact that you can like squirt the product exactly where you want it. Cause I actually do that with my shampoo already. It's just already concentrated. So um, I don't know that I like this so much. Um, I'm debating if I'll even finish the bottle cause like I said, it left my hair feeling pretty tangled. Um, the conditioner on the other hand, um, my hair somewhat felt the same way with the shampoo when I first put it on, like when I put it on to rinse it out. Um, but I will say that it did a great job at detangling my hair. I had some pretty hardcore knots in there and this stuff gave me some really great slips. So I do like um, the conditioner for detangling and it does say a dream detangler. So I do like it for detangling purposes only really. Um, I left it in as a deep conditioner and it was okay. Um, I've had better deep conditioners, but it did leave my hair feeling hydrated 
after I deep condition, but not after I put the conditioner in and rinsed it out right away. So if you wanted to hydrate your hair, you have to deep condition with it, um, but it is great for a detangler. So I would recommend it for detangling purposes only. Um, but I do like the consistency of it though. It was kind of cool to see it turn from like a jelly to a cream. So yeah, these are my thoughts on the product. I hope you all enjoyed the video and I hope you have a wonderful, awesome, spectacular day. Bye.